T N. So N's usually you want to be a little uh, bigger. Actually messed up. Uh, we need to make a display name, or you don't have to. You never have to do a display name. I always prefer to do a display name. So we're gonna make an N, and I'm going to fast forward this. Alright, so now that we have an in made, we're going to, you know, set up some events here. So I want to create the innkeeper. It's going to be just people. It's We'll have this guy, this pretty rich looking dude, and he's going to be like, hello, welcome to my inn. I, I am aware of the very... You know, the weird kind of things, but this guy talks weird, so you know we got I'm giving things just random flavor. I, I'm not caring, putting much care into the actual game itself, but you know, this is purely just for testing. This game's pure. The game I'm making is purely just for teaching. This is just teaching what you can do. I applaud people to actually try to make something at least somewhat of sub substance at first. I, I, I think for people's first game, they should really try to aim for maybe a Final Fantasy. Do do something basic. It's okay to have you know elements of the crystal or crystals of the elements. I mean, it's okay to do that if that's your first game. Uh, generally, just make something simple. Make something short, or make something long and simple or, you know, medium length, just make something simple first, and then go on to make something serious, then make the game you want, because you need to learn how to use the system first. Would you like a room? So, we're going to have the options, hell, hell yeah, and hell no. Okay, have a nice nap. <laughs> All right, so I, actually, let me let me redo this. We'll we will have a switch. We're gonna have a you know con we're gonna have a conditional branch. I mean, I'm sorry, I'm not good at talking much. I have a conditional branch. We're gonna make sure the character has uh, enough money. We're gonna make sure that your character has more than like, let's say like 50. So, you know, that, just sure. If create else, yeah. So, would you like a room? Only fifty G, and G is the currency in this game. You can change, you can change G to whatever currency you want. You can make a dollar or just R or whatever. You can make it whatever in the cog in the like system menu, I believe. You can change it to whatever. Uh, we'll just use the standard G for now. Uh, hell yeah. If G is 50, then please enjoy your stay. Please enjoy your stay. And else's fuck you, dumbass. 
dumb ass, dumb in the bass, dumb dumb ass. You ain't got enough of that. Of that. Of that. G girl, girl. <laughs> okay, please enjoy your rest. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make. Uh, we're going to change the gold. We're going to decrease it by 50. If you had that 50 gold to stay at the end, it's going to remove the 50 gold. So, if you have 50... Alright. So, if you have, you know, that much, uh, we're going to make it so... Well, we're going to make a cutscene. We're going to pretty much make our first kind of cutscene. And that'll be it for this episode. We're going to fade out the screen. We're going to wait. Uh, we're going to wait like about 180 frames. Uh, we're going to play ME, which is a you know, music effect. And we're going to play the N effect. Okay. We're gonna play ME and we're gonna put the text up. Your party, your party is fully restored. Alright, so now we're gonna want to recover all. This the entire party. We're gonna recover the entire party. And then we're going to uh, fade in the screen. And I believe this will work exactly perfectly I haven't used this version of the engine that much but it seems to be very close to VX aces which is what I use and I haven't made something in RPG maker in a while I do remember um, pretty much this working though so it should so we're going to uh, make the make this guy say thank you come again Thank you, come again. And then, you know, that'll be, you know, it. And then when you say no, he's going to be like, okay. Okay. There we go. Actually, I forgot. I'm, I'm a dumbass. I'm sorry. We're going to copy this here. <laughs> and we're going to make this not him. So we're going to make this event, uh, when the action button, we're going to copy that event. This guy right here, he's going to do nothing because we can't actually get to him, right? So we're just going to put this event here. Now, yeah, we've created our inn now. We've created, you know, a shop. We've, we've done about everything. So that wraps it up for this video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If, you, if there's any questions, uh, feel free to ask in the comments. I will answer as soon as I see them. And thank you.